Question 19. One gram of gold costs £32.94. pence. What is the cost of half a kilogram of gold? Well, remember, one kilogram is worth 1,000 grams. So half a kilogram is going to be worth half of this, which is 500 grams. Because half of 1,000 is 500 grams. So if one gram of gold, it costs £32.94, half a kilogram of gold is going to be 500 lots of this £32.94. So we want 500 times £32.94. Now, seeing as we've got two zeros on this 500, what it might be easier to do is to times our £32.94 by 5 first. So if we times it by 5, let's see where that takes us. So 5 times 4, that's 20. Put the 0 in, carry the 2. 5 9s are 45, plus the 2 is 47. Put the 7 in, carry the 4. 5 2s are 10, plus the 4 is 14. Put the 4 in, carry the 1. And 5 3s are 15, plus that 1 is 16. Put the 6 in, carry the 1. But because you've finished now and you've reached the end column, that 1 can just go in. Put your decimal point in, so it's lined up with this decimal point. So actually, 5 grams of gold would be £164.70. So let's just make that nice and clear. £164.70 for 5 grams. But we want 500 grams. And 5 grams times by 100 would give us 500 grams. So what we need to do is times this answer by 100. Now as you know, if you're multiplying by 100, you move all the digits two places to the left to make the number bigger. Because times 10, you move all the digits one place to the left, or one place forwards. Times 100, you move all the digits two places to the left, or two places forward. And times 1000, you would move all the digits three places to the left or three places forward so if we've got this 164 pound 70 all the digits are going to move two places forward because I need to times by 100 so if I put my decimal point in there now I can just move the digits two places forward so the one is going to go in one place into this column two places into this column. So the one has moved one, two places. The six has moved one, two places into this column. The four has moved one, two places into this column. Now you can do this for each individual digit, but obviously if the one, as long as you've got the one right, all the rest of the digits are going to just follow on. So it's going to go one, six, four, seven, zero, like that. So your final answer is £16,470. Just to recap, there are 500 grams in half a kilogram, so we need 500 lots of this £32.94. If you do 5 lots, you get this here, £164.70. So you make that 100 times bigger, move all the digits, 2 places forwards, so you end up with £16,470.